Investigators are looking for whoever lit six fires in North Portland early this morning. They say the fires were in vehicles and structures and all considered arson. Our Liz Birch is at one of those locations now, George's Corner Tavern. And Liz, I can only imagine how upset the owner is. Dan, absolutely. If you look behind me, you can see why a lot of it's been cleaned up, but you can still see all that destruction to the garage next to their bar and also to the patio of their bar as well. And he says this is coming at an especially difficult time for them. Early this morning, firefighters worked to put out a fire at a North Portland bar. The owner of George's Corner Tavern says he doesn't know who did this or why. Well, it's just really uh, unfortunate. Just a pure act of vandalism as far as we can tell. Dave Harmson says it's especially frustrating to be dealing with this damage just as COVID restrictions are lifting and as we go into a time that should be busy for them. I'm telling you, just as we're getting ready to reopen, right? It's all coming back and everything looks wonderful and then bam, we get hit with this. And we'll live to fight another day and we're still open, but we're going to lose part of our patio for a while. And with the Blazer game coming up Thursday and all that, it's like, really, now you're going to do this to me right now? Their bar was just one of six locations. Firefighters were busy putting out flames. And investigations from Engine 24, uh, if there's a pattern here, it likely started here. I'm guessing they went over the failing street bridge. The, uh, the pedestrian bridge and then maybe went north down on the interstate. This map shows that path of destruction. And Harmson says even though their bar is insured, this damage is costing them and the community. It's just too bad right now for everybody, the customers and the employees and, of course, the owners. Now, that owner does tell me that a neighboring business security camera caught somebody on video. We're working to learn more from the fire department about that. Of course, we'll keep you updated on coin.com. Live in Portland tonight, Liz Birch, Coin 6 News.